what is going on people it's bobby and welcome back to tomb raider legend this is the japan time trial uh, in this one we are going to be using the airwalk glitch so if you don't know how to do that yet make sure to go back to the peru time trial where i explain how that glitch works straight from the off on this in this level though we're just going to go down the stairs on the left press triangle on the bartender and then immediately start walking to the office you do not need to wait for the bartender to finish talking straight in and then once the cinematic starts you can skip it walk down the corridor and you're going to get another cinematic straight away now after this one immediately start aiming and shooting you're going to kill the guy in the middle first and kill the guy on the right and then kill this guy over here pick up this guy's gun and use it to kill the two guys Go there. Immediately made those guys, and the cutscene will start. There we go. The easy way of doing that bit. From here now, collect all the med packs and ammo, and then make your way forwards. Still can't skip this elevator, so just gonna have to watch it go all the way to the top. We are about to use the airwalk glitch now to get across the buildings without doing all the quick time events and the platforming. So let's use that. It's a really, really straightforward glitch to use, to be honest. So once again, making our way out, we're heading to the corner here. A building's going to spawn in front of us. That's the one we're going to. In order to do the glitch, you jump for the edge. As soon as Lara stumbles, just pull out your gun and then just start walking straight away and you'll be able to move through. Here, you're going to run forwards for a little bit and then come through this window here. Once you aim at the dogs, you can just drop down. They'll chase you and everything, but just press triangle on the door and you'll be fine. Okay, once you're up onto this one, up to this floor, straight through. It's not like they don't know you're there. Straight through the door ahead. You'll see them when I do. Here, I'm just going forwards. Killing this guy in the corner. And then the reason we're killing him is because he's really annoying. He'll just sit there shooting at us for ages. What the hell? There we go. Pull the TV down. Come over here so you're out the way. She's and then just use the stairs. Oh, come on, man. To get enough height. Just get up there. And then through the door. Still can't skip this part, outside. so we're just gonna have to make our way around. Oh, you know what that means. I'll get the diamond hydronate. Over here we go. Oh. Oh, Wait through round you go. Climb. Give that a pull once it's on its way down. Shoot the one above about three or four times. And that'll start swinging around. And then we can make our way up here. Just climbing up. Okay, once we get to this part now, normally you would jump across and swing down this platform before getting back on. Yeah, we can use the stumble glitch here though, but if you're even luckier, you can just land on the TV. Just give you... Little, another Constant little look at that, so we can see that actually happening. So we can angle Lara like towards it. Oh, she's done the thing again. They make me positively nauseous. Like I told her in On she gets. I'll try my best to keep you can my just chin up. Run along the TV and jump down. Oh well, all on the billboard. Not no TV, is it? But you know. Hurry, Lara. As we go. Lovely. Into the door. Sometimes this chandelier won't drop. I have no idea why. Sometimes it just doesn't drop. This is one of those times. See, it just won't drop, so we're just gonna have to kill these guys normally. The reason I'm choosing to kill these guys is because I want the med pack they drop the shot on us really annoying. Over and over them. I just want a couple of med packs here, so 
that's why. It's a chance for me to get a couple of med packs and go out of here with full health. So take that chance to kill those guys. Now, if you want to maintain your med packs, you want to come and grab the ball. Yes. Um, you don't have to use the ball, but obviously. I don't know how good everyone is at the game or how experienced should have said when it was game. So if you're less experienced, use the ball. If not, roll down the hall and just use your med pack to stop the turret from killing you. Because you'll be able to kill the boss without using them essentially. From here. I made the guy on the left on the left. So you get a kill, guaranteed. Even if he runs off, the guy on the right will still be there. There, wicked. Okay, Pull the dragon towards us, next. and then come and stand over here on the left. It's gonna smash the window. Two guys are gonna spawn, one on either side of the window. But if you stand in here, the guy on the left will have to peek out to come and get us. And then he'll just peek back in there. Stand here and kill him. Climb up. Check your ammo if it's low like mine is. On the table over here, multiple assault rifles. The fastest way of doing the boss uses a shotgun, but the safer ways don't use a shotgun, which is why I'm not bothering. I've got plenty of time now at this point, I don't need to do it the fastest way. So I'm just going to continue on. Waiting for the cutscene. In the cutscene, if you wait for Lara, to, wait to see Lara's back, you'll be able to spawn in facing forward straight away which will make it way easier to get up here. We're gonna swipe at you first, and then we're just gonna make our way over to him. Okay, got him with a couple of grenades, that's good. That'll make the kill a bit faster now from here. Definitely got us those two. No problem. There he is. And there you have it. That is. Once we skip the cutscene anyway, that is Japan's time trial done and dusted with over six minutes remaining. Hopefully this video has helped. If it has, make sure to like and subscribe. Any issues or questions, leave a comment down below and I'll get on that. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.